Hey guys, it's Random Sex Listener here, and I just have to say I'm so hyped because I started to multitask. Like, I actually did a very simple fast multitask. So, before I started to record um, the Yandere Tales X Listener, um, the quote unquote breakup, um, I was doing um, a small spoiler here. If you don't want to get spoiled, then skip. Um, so, he booted up the, the, the he booted up Sonic EXE because he wanted to get revenge and everything after you ran away and you came back to him crying which you will see in the video um and then so yeah I did that I found a um voice changer in my app that actually it doesn't change your voice to Sonic EXE but it it was very similar plus I tried to thicken up my voice a little to sound like him and it sounded very much alike i i'm very happy and i'll see you guys at the end of the video i'm running out of time here and thank you guys so much for all your love and support this is gonna take a long time to export because i i did accidentally deleted the other version and i'll see you guys at the end of the video bye so this isn't really Yandere Tales, this is like crazy scientist look-alike tales. Um, so, <clears throat> it was just a normal day, really. It got kind of cloudy, and you went back home, and then like, this was, um, this was like, a few days after, um, Tails did, did what, whatever he did. It was actually after Knuckles and everything. You found out Tails did that after everybody did what they did. Because Tails, he acted innocent. Like, he didn't do anything, really. And you kind of forgot the day he came back with, like, he was all bloody with gore and everything all over him. You kind of forgot that happened. And then you saw your friend's mom on the news saying, oh, he they died and everything and my my innocent um boy slash daughter slash they them and everything and then the only person that you thought it could be was tails and so you tested him until he actually snapped and told you the truth so here it goes oh hey listener um what's up What? What do you mean? I don't know anything about a family death. Who could have died? I'm so sorry for their loss. Huh? So you basically turned the TV on and showed him. I don't know anybody named blank. Or anybody named it. I don't know anybody named it. What do you mean? I wasn't there that night. Listener, I, I'm telling the truth. I wasn't there. I was at home. On the couch. Y you don't remember? Listener, you have to trust me. I was home. He started to get pissed. Listener, I'm telling the truth. I was home that day. I wasn't snooping around. And why would I kill such such an innocent being? Listener, for the last damn time, I wasn't there that night. Then you were like, then why are you getting so mad? Why are you pissed off? If you weren't there that night, then why are you getting so frustrated? Basically, you were just testing him and everything like that. I'm not frustrated. It's just because I'm pissed of telling you over and over and over again that I wasn't there that night. Ooh, 
you saw a side of tales you never knew existed. You know what? You know what, listener? If you want to know so bad, then you're going to know. Yeah, yeah, I was there that night, listener. I was there that night. And by the way, the voice I'm trying to do is like more Sonic Boom Tales. And the voices I try to do uh, most of the time in the Sonic series are like Sonic Boom and everything. Like, Young Tales was when you started the relationship. And then like, I do kind of older 12 year old um, tales when it comes to like the relationship like sonic boom and everything yeah yeah i was there that night i killed it i killed them i did it for you i did it all for you i didn't want them harming you in any way i found out everything I tested them before stabbing them over and over and over again. Oh, sir, you little pathetic ass D doesn't remember the day where I came home all bloody. Oh, you don't. Yeah. So is that what you wanted? To get that out of me? Yeah, now you got it out of me. Now you know I did it all for you. It was all for you, listener. All for you. So he was basically just getting closer to you. And then you said, just basically get away from me, you psychopath and stuff like that. Um, and you said, psychopath now. Now you're calling me a psychopath? <laughs> I'm not a psychopath, darling. I just, I just did what was best for you. I kind of sound like John Doe. I did what was best for you, and now you're calling me a a psychopath. And then so, after calming him down, he kind of forgot what happened since it was like an hour later. You sat him down. It was just the two of you. And you said clearly to him, there, there, you, you were just straight. You were straight onto it. And you said, Tails, I want to break up with you. That means you're basically out of this relationship. And I'm sorry to inform you. What? Wait. You're breaking up with me? Wait, why? Listener, why? What? What did I do? And then you explain you never seen that side of him and everything like that. And you didn't like it. He, he grabbed your arm. He had a good old grip on it. And he said, you can't break up with me, right? You know you can't. Can't. You, you can't. You can't just leave me. Right? You, you can't leave me like this. Oh, darling, you can't leave me. Oh, you will never leave me. Never. Ever. We're staying together forever. Never and never. So it's basically that one scene from John Doe, the, the game, where it, it's just going and ever and ever and ever like that. He's, he's not saying, he's saying it, like, whispering it kind of-ish. And he gets close enough to you to kiss you. And, and basically, you just couldn't do anything. He was just holding you. Like, really tightly. <sniffs> Smoochy time. <sighs> We're going to stay together forever, my love. You can't get away from me, you know that. Oh, you're not getting away from me so easily now. He grabs you again. Uh, I'm sorry to inform you this, um, whoever's listening to this audio. So basically, you get knocked out. You're in a basement. This is literally the scene from Yonder Simulator when you um, kidnap Kona. Um, I'm sorry, video game spoilers. So, you're tied to a chair. And it's tails in front of you. There are, so basically this is kind of like the comic dub 
where it's uh, him going crazy scientist on Amy. If you haven't seen that, check that out. If it's still around and YouTube didn't take it down, I forgot the name of it. So there were needles, there were things that you'd never seen, just like medical stuff. There were like a little bit of blood around since he did test on animals before, but like for good things, not bad things. There were, there was a bat. And that's all a bat as a weapon that he beat the crap out of your friend with. And he said, oh, look, dear, you're awake. That's good. I didn't want you sleeping forever. I thought I hit your head too hard. Yeah, he hit your head with the bat. <laughs> mm. Oh, what's the terrified face for? What's wrong? Are you scared of me? Oh, now, darling, you should be. You shouldn't have tested this side of me now, should, should you? You shouldn't have. <laughs> oh, darling, you did something really bad. Really, really bad. You went over the limit of my sanity. It just kept going lower and lower and lower until I couldn't take it anymore. And, and then, like, you just said you're a monster and everything like that. And he said, oh, I'm a monster now. I'm sorry to say this, love, but the only monster here is you. You lowered your friend in to have feelings for you. And what did you do? You let that pass by. You didn't even see it coming. Like, it was obvious. Your friend always gave you flowers, chocolate, but it seemed like you never noticed. They were into you. Very into you. I'm not a psycho. He, they were. They were crazy for you. You should have seen their room filled with pictures of you. At least I'm not a psychopath. Or a yandere that will fill my room with pictures of my own lover. Do I do that now? No, I don't. Now I doubt it. If, I, if you go through my stuff, will you find thousands upon thousands of pictures of you? No, you won't. So the only yandere psychopath was them, not me. I'm just very overprotective of you. You're part of my property. And what does that mean? I can be very, very overprotective of you. You remember the last time? I almost. <sighs> Sorry to remind you of this, but I almost did hurt Shadow one time from playing around with me, saying that you were only his. Oh, I got so mad at him. <laughs> oh, I did. Good thing you helped me back, darling. Or he would have gotten badly injured. <laughs> well then, how about this? You spend some time with me. And I'll let you go. And we can all forget this happened. Right.
darling. Oh, goody. Well, then. Come on now. So basically, you two were spending time together, and later on, um, he, you finally snapped and said a bunch of things to him, and he said, <laughs> "Is that so? Is that so? You are disloyal." You betrayed me on your word and you ignorant, pathetic, forgotten. You really thought you could get away with this. You basically were trying to knock him out, but yeah, he just grabbed that bat real quick. So is this how it is? Hmm? Well, then we'll see about that. And, like, you ran away for a few hours. You were in the woods, and then you came back. And you came back to Tails crying. Like, I mean, like, I don't think I should change the image, really. <laughs> Listen up. Oh. Hi. What do you want? You're here to apologize? Why? Why? I I should be the one apologizing. I did something terrible. I was tomorrow. You you need to hide. You need to run away as fast as you can for an hour. Okay. I can't tell you what's going on. You're going to freak out. I, I, I really can't. I should be the one apologizing. I'll tell you all about that later. But I'm really, really sorry, listener. I shouldn't have done those things to you, and I shouldn't have so shown that side of me. Psychopathic, overprotective, selfish. I really worry about you and the people you hang around with. Please, don't break this promise that whenever, whenever you see they're interested in you, just tell them you're not interested and you already have someone, okay? Please promise me that. I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm really sorry, my love. Um, actually, I, I really didn't do anything terrible. It's just that I broke something and... And I told you to run away so I could fix it. He was lying, you could clearly tell. But you just went with it. Yeah. I, I broke something and... Uh... I wanted to fix it, so I told you to run away for an hour, because that's the time I needed. Yeah, I, I can still fix it, though. Yeah. I, I, I love you. Okay, listener? Just know that I love you very much, and I don't want to let go of you. Ever. Okay? You're my love, my sweetness. The the thing I love about this world is is you. You make and you light up my world. You're my sweetness. Maybe sometimes my sourness and <sighs> sometimes I can be a jackass. I can be mean. I can be selfish. What do you mean I'm not selfish? How? I'm always thinking about myself and nobody else. It's impossible for me not to be selfish. Fine, fine. Yes, 
your right. I do think about everybody most of the time. And I do care about others very much, especially you. Not just the others, but I care about you the most. And it's the pure truth. I love you, okay, listener? Mm -hmm. Make sure you get some rest tonight. <sighs> Please forget about what happened. Leave the past behind us. Mm -hmm. Look forward to the future. Come on now. Um, you need some rest. Here. Um, before you came in, I, I made extra hot cocoa. It was probably for Sonic, but he's already asleep, so here you go. Have a good night, okay, listener? I I really do love you. Um, by the way, after all I did, I really shouldn't be asking this. Do you want to cuddle, listener? Okay. Okay, um, here. You're really cozy. Well then, good night, listener. I love you very much. Please don't forget that. I. I'm really sorry about what I did. I really am. I'm really sorry. I hope you can forgive me. I'm really sorry, listener. I really, really am sorry. Okay, okay, I'll stop now. Well then, go to sleep. Okay? <laughs> we have a big day tomorrow. He like already forgot that he booted up the game, if you know what I mean. <sighs> Good night, listener. Love you. And that's all for today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, leave your requests and suggestions down below my Instagram and the songs I use will be in the description below I am so hyped for the Sonic EXE version and for you guys to see it I am so sad the fact that I'm having to remake this real quick but I'll see you guys in the next video bye